Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a get ready with me, you know, nothing too out here. First things first, I'm going to moisturize my face. Now is the time for small business owners everywhere to grow your business further. <laughs> Babe, you can talk to in the video, just so you know, because there's parts where I'm going to cut out, so don't feel like you can't talk. I was going to say, you shouldn't even cut out sometimes when I talk to you. No, I know. So sometimes you should just let me say stuff. Like, babe, I think you need another shot. <laughs> I'll say stuff like that. Not yet. I know. We're watching um, 90 Day Fiance the other way. And we're so into this show right now, guys. It's so good. Um, I don't think Karina really wants to get back together. I think we're probably going to end up falling apart at this point. Um, yeah, right. It's not gonna work out. I don't know about you guys, but you guys should always moisturize down your neck and on your chest too. Because you get wrinkles there too. I love the way this looks. I want to use this new primer that I got in my BoxyCharm palette. I think it was in the October one. But anyway, it's called Glassy by. by it's called Glassy by Touch and Soul or Touch and Soul. I already have. Um, obviously, my eyebrows on and a little bit of mascara. But that's it. I'm still gonna do eyeshadow and everything. I'm not boring and I'm not even going anywhere I just wanted to post a video and this is kind of like a popular video like I like watching these types of videos like it's funny I mean I'm not that funny but I'm gonna go in with my foundation or wait I'm gonna do my eyes first okay so the palette that I'm going to be using for my eyes is my was, this Tarte palette. Right? Like, it's um, called the Clay you know, Play Face it's Shaping it's Palette. It's like a um, contour palette, but it also has eyeshadow. And I'm going to be using ever, this tonight. Like, so, everybody. first things first, I'm going to just oh, take a random fluffy on. brush, um, you know, so something like this. Just a random cheap fluffy brush and I'm gonna go in with this white color right here. I have an eyeshadow primer but I'm not gonna do all that right now. We're supposed to do so much together. Where's his dad at? I was really looking forward to have him come. Damn. You're in mental critical condition. I'm gonna go in with this one. I can just imagine if he just went away for a while. Right here. I love how I'm finally doing another get ready with me because the first video that I did was a get ready with me and it's my mostly viewed video right now so hopefully this one gets more views too because lately my videos views have just been going down I'm gonna take another smaller brush it's just like another blending brush hmm. this contour color right here because all the other ones, like, I feel like I wanted to use this one or that one, but they're just too dark. And I'm not really going for an orangey look, you know? It's the contour shade Timber, but I'm going to use it as an eyeshadow. I'm 
I'm just slowly building up this color, you know. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with a little bit of a smaller brush than this and go in with that brown color right here. to come out to my mom and the reaction I got from my mom wasn't the greatest but the reaction I had from her or not I was still going to be me and still had a girlfriend and I've always told her that if you can't accept who I am even though she was my mom I had no problems saying don't call me unless you're going to call me with I love you and I want to be a part of your life and I'll accept you and it only took my mom maybe a couple months to come around and I love my daughter and I accept it because I love my daughter and I don't want her out of my life. I'm gonna go back in with the first brush that I used to just kind of blend it all in. So taking my BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette I used this a few times in some of my videos, but um, taking this like shimmery green, kind of shimmery, spray it. But I look kind of crazy right now because I have no lashes on and no foundation, but just trust the process. So the thing about the BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette, when you swatch the colors like just on your um, wrist or just without anything like type of spray or anything, it's not that pigmented but when you spray it with like some fix plus on your brush, look, I mean it speaks for itself. I brought the green up a little bit more just because the way my eyelids are, they always transfer anyway. So I kind of tried to make it like a cut crease. I'm so upset right now. And it's working out. Just so because I forgot his credit card at home. I'm not mad at it. The, best that I and the colors are showing. Especially actually. being pregnant, I'm even more scared that all this added stress could lead to Donald's relapsing. So fast because you're so pissed. Go. Give me the juice. You know I had to do the green look, inspiring what we're drinking. It's very hard. We're going to be ready to face all the challenges ahead of us. <clears throat> Going in with my Hank and Henry slick with it eyeliner and it's in the color blickety black this part you guys are not going to be able to see that well so i might just fast forward it because i have to have the mirror really up close but you know i'll try uh, okay Here. 
First, I'm just gonna outline both eyes and then try to do the wing. Every time I do my eyeshadow, parts of my eyebrow comes off. And it's so annoying, so I'm just gonna fix that real quick. If anyone is wondering, I do my eyebrows with eyeshadow. I used to use Dip Brow, and I like Dip Brow, but I only have it in the color blonde. And I was, I mean, my hair is still pretty light, but now I use kind of like a medium brown. I was using this when my hair was like platinum blonde. And yeah, this worked really good. I just never really wanted to spend like another $20 on another Anastasia Dip Brow because my eyeshadow works just the same. Oh my God, by the way, guys, so today I passed my driver's test. Um, uh, a lot of you probably thought I already had my license because I've been driving, but no. Y'all can go ahead in front and act like, oh, we're driving without a license. But you know what? I know so many people who do it and some sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do. If, you know, like, what if I don't wanna take Uber? Uber is not always the safest choice. And I know a lot of people, a lot of people who still be driving, like age 25 and up with no license. And nothing happens. You only get pulled over if you don't know how to drive. So, yeah. Oh, shut up. Let me do this real quick. No, I'm going to take it right after I conceal this. I can't mess this up. This is important. I'm editing it. It's a process. You never edited a video on iMovie on an iPhone. You know how long that should take? I'm sitting here editing videos for you guys who can't even like my videos. You guys are so unappreciative. So unappreciative. Will I complete my makeup if I do this? This video is just getting longer. Okay. It's hilarious. He's trying to fit. I'm really about to make You're about to rip them. <laughs> You're making fart sounds with my boots trying to put them on. <laughs> you did not. You did not. He actually fit. The original SpongeBob SquarePants boots. Give me a kiss. Okay, so the lashes that I have are these ones. Um, I think they were called like Minx, Fox Minx, or something Minx with it. And it came in a whole other box, but I threw that away because obviously I don't need the box. But I love these lashes though, guys. They're like awesome. I used to never wear lashes, but recently I've been starting to wear them. First, it was an issue applying them because I just sucked at applying lashes. Like I just didn't know how to do it. But now that I know how to, it's so much easier because I don't have to put so much mascara on. And it just takes less time, you know, like you can just rip off your eyelash and then you barely have any mascara on left to take off. Give me a full one. They're broken. I knew I didn't know everything about what she was doing. I knew that she's in the first one. So 
something that he should have told me before I even made the decision to okay. talk through it. Hey, hey. It's just blue. A store. Other eyelash. Other eyelash. It's about freaking time because this video is at one hour and eight minutes and 17 seconds now. So, <laughs> come on now. This is ridiculous. This is why I don't record these types of videos. Because most of the time I can't even get them done. I've been trying to record this video for like a week. And I've been drinking for a week straight. Because of this fucking video that has never been published. But. Here it is now. Okay. Babe, pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Mm -mm. You dropped it. Yeah. No, we're just sleeping in a second. Bruh. What? I'm good. So the meet you finally. Welcome. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Yeah, little horses, honey. We're going to go for a ride. <laughs> nah, just kidding. I can never imagine myself being with somebody like that. Okay, so for foundation. <laughs> I already did all that. Okay, so for foundation, this is still drying. It looks so freaking stupid because it's not dry. It looks all white. I don't know why this one dried normal. And this one looks all weird. I can't hear my fucking recording. So for foundation, I'm going to be using my Revolution Conceal and Define Full Coverage Foundation. This is honestly kind of really body, but whatever. I know that for um, winter, my skin is going to get a little bit more pale because the sun isn't going to be out. And in winter time, I always get more pale, so I'm not really too worried. This is probably gonna be a good match by that time. Going in with my Max Fix Plus before I go and blend everything in. This is my mini one. Just hydrate and kind of set my face at the same time. You know, gotta get it ready for the blending process. God, this foundation is so light. I'm gonna do the best I can. Again. Eu nunca tinha encontrado a mãe do povo antes, então eu não sei como ela se sente em relação a mim. Às vezes eu não sei o que eu faço para ela. I think my concealer is actually a better match for my foundation than my actual foundation. And there's cats and dogs that are born in around two. And The Revolution Luxury Baking Powder in it's in I told I guess the color bananas. With the excess rest of the powder that I have, I'm gonna take a big fluffy brush and then set the rest of my face. I know I don't know. I don't really see a lot of like people do that, like set the rest of their face. They kinda just put foundation on and then kind of go on with their contour mm -hmm. powder yeah, but when I do that okay. I just feel like it looks and really muddy is. and smudgy oh, so I like to use person. like the baking powder I use for under my eyes and just use a little bit to set the rest of my face before I go in with like contour, blush and all that. This is about to drive me so crazy. I'm so tired of having this foundation on my lips. Like honestly, it's getting ridiculous. So I'm about to take that off. I'm just gonna go in with the BH Cosmetics palette again and finish off my eyes because I did want to add a little bit more green to the inner corner but just a brighter green. Be mixing these two colors and I'm gonna place that in the inner corner of my eye. Thank you. 
some of the green like the bright green that i'm using to uh for my inner corner i'm gonna use to kind of blend into my eyeshadow and just make it a little bit more equal my smashbox is a gambling um, addict he's still very the cali contour palette i'm gonna be financial pressure on him using this shade trigger. and oh, this shade to contour i'm gonna be mixing both he colors to come up with this. This is a blush palette. Guaranteed to fit. For us, Alamar Cosmetics. And then on top of that, I'm gonna be using another blush. It's by Becca. And this is in Lilac Geode. I don't, it's called a Shimmering Skin Perfector. I don't know if it's a blush or a highlighter, you but know, this I mean, is what, what it looks was like. Worse than anything I could have ever imagined at his house. He had just come here in the morning and his phone started ringing. Going and back in with this, I'm going to be using these two colors. I it and there was a man standing there with some it. And he said, The shimmery you, shades, and I'm going to be using them to contour my nose. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and highlight. We are almost done with the look. Congratulations, highlighters! I jumped up and ran into my living room. I'm using the one in the rest of his family showed golden peach lights. They're just golden lights. I think it's just golden lights actually. Uh, I'm gonna go in with a NYX lip liner. This is the shade Whipped Caviar. It's a matte lip liner and I'm gonna outline my lips. I don't know if you guys were able to see that or not, but okay, next. Um, this is the Iconic London Lip Gloss, and this is in the shade Love Struck, and it's a lip plumping gloss. I got this in my last BoxyCharm, and it's, I love it so far. Last step, I'm not really gonna do my hair or anything like that, because there's no reason to, but.